You can add a 3D effect to a shape by selecting the shape, clicking the Format tab if necessary, and clicking on the 3D Effects button, and then clicking on the 3D Effects button again. Um, it's set right now to have no 3D effect. As you hover your mouse over these options, uh, they're going to show you in the main document what it's going to look like if you apply it to that shape. You have uh, parallel 3D effects, you have perspective 3D effects, and you have some rotated perspective effects. Um, I'm going to go ahead and choose this one. I'm going to go ahead and go back to that again. And I'm going to choose a 3D color now. And as you see this, um, as you hover it over again, it's going to be applied. Let's go there again. You can also control the depth of how deep you want the 3D effect to go. I'm going to go ahead and stick with 36. The direction, you can choose which direction this is going. You can also choose the lighting. You can choose where the light source is coming from. And you can also choose to have that light source be bright, normal, or dim. You can also choose to have a different surface. Um, you can keep with the mat, or you could choose plastic, metal, or wire frame. Um, you can also tilt your 3D effect by choosing 3D effect again and then clicking on the button to tilt up, right, down, or left. If you click this button right here, then it's going to turn your 3D um, either on or off. It's going to toggle between the two.